a little bit more in Autumn's favor. And I'm not, oh, the PK Fire, yeah, it'll just blast them out, but she has, yeah, just that one little, uh, little stun ball, I guess you could call it. Oh, yeah, didn't even expect that. He can actually just, uh, chew that up with the, uh, the side magnet. Again, the neutral control, not finding any purchase, but then he gets a throw opportunity, goes in with the double neutral. Oh, side magnet almost, uh, kidding Corrin as well. Gets the grab in, and Autumn is just taking it to seven right now. Dragging him 88 after that forward smash. Forcing him off stage, too. You gotta watch out for throws in the near future, especially uh, if he tacks on about maybe 15 more damage. And again, eating it up. <laughs> Healing up with that uh, side magnet. It's gonna be a little trouble. And a fast fall mistake. Will be it. chalked it up to uh, uh, an SD there for seven, I believe. Let's see if he can bounce right back from. But again, he is so on point with catching them. I think he's only been hit by maybe one or two, but he's captured about uh, three or so now. That time he didn't go, and he got the dragon bite as well. He's got to be careful with that long range. He's expecting it because that's the only option that Corn has to attack Lucas at long range, unless he goes in with the uh, the lance pierce. But he has to get in pretty close as well to do that. And although he does have the longest, uh, or Corrin does have the longest forward smash in the game as well. Beating out the Monado, which I'm still mad at. There you go. More of a long reach with that, but it is pretty risky because that leaves you vulnerable as well. So if they perfect shield it and run in, there's potential to get hit as well. PK fire pressure again, but he is at 129. Looking on his way out here, especially with how low he's going. And a great Lance Pierce, but uh, Lucas's uh, up B is a lot better than Ness's, and he will recover back. Right now, just take it, but a great counter recognition from the forward air from Lucas. A great job from Seven turning that around, and this is still completely doable for Seven. He just has to have a little bit more control of the neutral and just not be throwing out those. Uh, 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 the, the, the stun balls. I forget like the actual name for it, but still, uh, because that's what's leading Lucas to eat up the uh, the damage that he's taking right now. Great pressure with the uh, uh, the lance pierce, but a couple of jabs from Autumn will give him more even shield pressure as well. Coming in with a bite, that was a good option because that forced him to either roll away or take the hit. Basically, didn't get the full jab. Uh, Autumn was able to jump out of it went really, uh, really ham with that, uh, down smash. Good backing away, but he's gotta be, oh, with the deflection, can he capitalize? No, he wasn't able to capitalize off the de deflection. Very nice. Seven trying to play a little more aerial game and just keeping on this platform, keeping pressure while not using the dragon fang shot. Thank you, the panda, for that. And the counter again might, s oh, no, okay, yeah, that was a little weak. It was a weak hit, too. Oh, that was really risky going in with that forward smash, but it paid off. Almost gets the uh, read with that for, uh, reverse forward smash. And he comes through. Just, yeah, good job on Autumn retreating and a back throw, and that will edge it out. Oh, I was wondering, like, who, who was that talking? But I, I just remembered Corn has a couple lines when she uh, dies sometimes. Well, yeah, that was very close. Seven was able to turn that around. In the, uh, he was very close to turning it around. Uh, but, yeah, great awareness from Autumn, and he is opting to go Yoshi, okay. Um, I'm not sure about that pick, Autumn. Okay, yes, good. Uh, no, okay, he's sticking with it. All right. Uh, I'm not too sure about this pick. He was doing fine with Lucas. It, it was pretty close, but he seemed to have a good amount of, uh, even stage control as well as just control in general. Uh, it came down to, like, a, a lot of key, uh, key moments that Seven was able to try to turn that around. But already, Autumn shown that he has also practiced with Yoshi as well, and the egg shot interrupting that uh, Lance Pierce. Dragon Fang shot, not gonna find anything, and Autumn looking for a setup. I'm not going to find anything in the air here, so a little bit more ground game. And that down air is so devastating. If you get hit with it, it racks up a fair amount of damage.
but if you don't and you shield it, it does an insane amount of shield pressure. Almost whittles it down entirely. Great tech after that uh, forward air uh, spike. But the jab, and here comes the shield break coming through, and a forward smash will take it out. What an incredible setup from Autumn. Seven trying to find his way in right now after that set of circumstances. He's shaking it off, and he's racking up the majority of the damage here, but Autumn is starting to turn it around a little bit. Seven coming in with the jab. Getting a lock, but not capitalizing off of it. Dragon Fang not coming through. Tries to get a little more shield pressure, but then again, Autumn has some of his own. with that, Again, with that down air, such a good shield pressure tactic. And now he can play the ranged game because he does have the two-stock advantage. And sitting at only 91%, it's fairly okay. Uh, he needs to rack up a little bit more damage for any uh, smash, I believe, to counter like that. Or to, to kill like that, sorry. But right now, uh, Autumn seeming to have a little bit of trouble moving in. And that Lance Pierce almost kills off the top. Wow. Shield back and forth. Shield coming in and out, just keeping up the mind games. And a great forward air, up air uh, setup. Looking for a counter kill. Not going to find it. And also, great recognition to go forward after Autumn dropped the shield. And he'll be able to chalk it up at a 107. It might be too little too late, especially with the forward smash again. And that will edge it out for Autumn. He will win 2-0 against Seven and will advance to winner's round four. Wow. What a great match. You don't see a lot of these uh, characters in the, uh, the top eights or anything in big tournaments. But hey, we make them look like they're pretty good to use.